my spiritual master he is calling he said that he would like to go to america I said, you are you crazy? The old man, you are going to die. Someone told you the story, he wouldn't believe it. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. He's 70 years old, he has no money, he's starting an effort, and it turns into an international movement. Everyone is thinking, I'm American, I'm Indian, I'm European, I'm Australian. But I'm not this body. I am a spirit soul. He looked like the Prime Minister of the Galaxy. Prabhupada was quite unlike any teacher we'd ever known. There was no gap between what he spoke and what he lived. The Vedic scriptures gave some sort of backbone to my life. People were joining left and right. Everywhere people went, there were Hare Krishnas. Many would consider members of the Hare Krishna sect to be dangerous religious fanatics, but the Krishnas say they're simply misunderstood. People would kidnap us and try to deprogram us. The more he got attacked, the more energized he began. Prabhupada loved a good fight. He was actually bringing some kind of ray of light to uh, the right place. Regardless of race, of religion, of nationality, we are all brothers and sisters. If I see this person, this soul, struggling just like I'm struggling in my body, I have a reason to love you. That's deep. His words carry so much power. It's a full expression of his heart that comes through. on this life is to understand oneself. This is the beginning.